Welcome to YouTube Excel Lookup Function number six. Hey, if you want to download this workbook, click on my YouTube channel, and then click on my college website link and download the workbook Excel Lookup Function series one to fifteen. Hey, in number six, we're going to see how to use the H Lookup. All of us know how to use V Lookup, but how in the world do we use H Lookup? Well, the first thing is V in V Lookup means vertical, and H in H lookup means horizontal. Look at that. Horizontal. Let's just highlight right here, Control C. Click right in this cell, right click, pay special, or however you get to pay special. Boop. And let's say transpose. Oh, hey, look, that's a vertical table because the lookup values are vertically orientated. H lookup just means they're horizontally orientated for our lookup. If I copy this and then right click, paste special, transpose, there I'm gonna like do that. So we'll look up product three. Hey, here's a cool trick. If you have a formula like that and then you hit F2 and F9, F2 and F9, it will convert that formula to a value. Oops, I'm gonna do that again equals this one right here and then F2 and then F9 and enter and it converts it to a formula. Boy, that's a weird trick. All right, uh, let's do vertical lookup just to remind ourselves how this works. Here's our lookup value, comma, here's our table. Oh, look, vertically orientated, comma, it's going to find it in the second column. We don't need the final argument. Oh, we do need, because when we have words or we're looking up exact matches, we definitely want not true, not approximate match, but false ma um, false for exact match. Of course, we know false is 0 and true is 1, so much easier to just put a 0 like that. Hey, it found 50. $15 right there. Now let's do H lookup. If you know how to do this, you know how to do H lookup. Ready? Equals H lookup. H lookup. Hey, where is the lookup value? Right there. Comma. Where is the table? Just like we know how to do vertical lookup. I'm going to move my screen tip when I see that little cursor. I can go zoop. And notice it says row index instead of column index. Here's row one. Here's row two. So I'm going to put a comma two. And then it wants to know uh, whether it's a tr approximate or exact match. So zero for exact match. And another um, two important points about HLOOKUP, which are exactly true and we talked about in earlier uh, videos here for VLOOKUP. These, no, these numbers or words right here, when you have an exact match with a zero right here as the fourth argument, it doesn't matter what order they're in. Ah, But if you do an approximate match by having a one as the fourth argument or the default nothing, they have to be sorted in ascending order. Ascending order. Hey, that means smallest to biggest. Hey, how would you, uh, so there you go. That's um, the H lookup. I'm going to click right here. I'm going to say equals this right here and then do that trick again, F2, F9. And sure enough, it changes. The price changes to 15. All right, that's H lookup. If you know how to do vertical lookup, you know how to do H lookup. All right, see you next lookup function series.